trying on. So we were at Target and I picked this up instead of an AJ Styles figure. So let's see if the Lego Movie 2 set 70821 Emma and Benny's Build and Fix Workshop is better than an AJ Styles figure. So, uh, yes. Now makes sense to figure out how to open it. Oh. You have to tear out the... the package. But then it totally wrecked the box. So I didn't totally wreck the box. It still looks good from the front, so... Here's all that you get. I'm just gonna... This is bag one and two. I think this is for Benny's spaceship, and then this is the rest of it. So I'll start the time lapse now.
Alrighty then, after that long and tedious series of events, um, that was only like four or five minutes for you, for me it was about fifteen. More because I had dinner in between. So we're going to be starting off with bag one, which means we're going to push this part off. So this is Emmett's side of the build. And we're going to be starting off with this. And now one good thing is... This is a printed tile and not a sticker tile, which is really good since I am not good with putting on stickers. Uh, it's got this like gas valve, um, two thingies, and this railing that you are supposed. What you're supposed to do is use. Um, this is a part that you didn't see in time lapse since I didn't open it up since I. Didn't really see the point, but this will come in also later. We have these like black pieces, and you're supposed to put them in there. I it's a pretty fine build. I like the fact that this is a printed tile on this colored, um, slanted, like this one by six slanted piece, and uh, what is that like dark? Almost fully dark green, and yeah, I'm sure it's not seven o'clock yet. Um, in fact, uh, we'll actually look at the minifigure now. This is uh, Emma Brickowski. Um, it's a pretty standard build. He's got like you actually can't. Oh yeah, the light reflecting off of it. Uh, I mean, it's a pretty standard minifigure. He's got a standard minifigure smile. We uh. Spin this around, he's got a much more angered look to him. Which I personally like this one better, I have to be honest. And for the next build, it's this like little cart with um a, a drawer piece. I You can attach it to something, I'm not sure what, but this is so you can like hold tools and stuff. It's pretty fine. It's a pretty cool build. Or, I know what this is for. It's for, like, something like this. Or like, one of these pieces here. Yeah, it's like for something like those. Uh, and then for the meat and potatoes of this build, you have Emmett's car. Which, if I sit him down, he has to push his arms up a tad bit. It's actually, it's actually a pretty cool car build for um, Emma. I like this one. Uh, I mean, I personally got it for the ve this set for the vehicles, and I'm actually gonna tell a story about this one. This set, um, it's gonna be a tad weird for me. To talk about the. Uh, I'm also gonna have to talk about that. that. Oh, you're. Wait, ah, there we go, that's better. Okay, yeah, false alarm. Didn't snap it down properly. Uh, you got fires in the back, which is a pretty cool piece, actually. Uh, it's, uh, trans red and, like, translucent red and orange. I like that. And uh, they just pop in the back. Uh, spoiler pieces. Uh, I like, I like, um, this front piece, this front piece, I like, I, I would like to get it without this part, but still, that's a pretty cool piece, and then there, this piece is fine, most of the time I'm not even noticing it's there, due to the way the build is, but now that that part is done, and all of these roll fine, now, we're done with bag one, we're now moving on to bag two, which has a few builds. So up first is the Benny minifigure, and he, he has some jetpack, and you can already see his expression. I like the beat-up tags and the, like, split helmet piece, I like that. Um, his reverse expression, you already saw it when I was 
showing the jetpack piece. It's a uh, pretty scared Benny. Yeah, he does have a jetpack piece so he can fly around. Woohoo! And I'm just gonna turn that around because I like his happy face better. And the first build is this miniature car. Which, I mean, is actually kind of a pretty cool look. But there is one thing, though. Why can't he grab the steering wheel? But it does roll around just fine, especially, like, I'm sure if I... Let me just test that. Yeah, even on carpet, it, it moves fine, but... I have it on my ring, because this is where my main meat and potatoes is. I don't know else, where else I would put it. Like, where I do this series of LEGO reviews. LEGO review. And then the meat and potatoes of this bag is Benny's spaceship. Uh, I like um, this back. The accelerators. What I wish they would have done, in fact, I actually am going to take the... I'm going to replace this later, but... Oh, I just took out the entire build. Um, that box. I wish we got four of these trans pieces. In fact, it doesn't even fit, but I wish you could stick two of these in the sockets and have it... Look like it's flying out in space. I think that would have been like really cool. But it's a pro it's a really good build. But I and I I know it's this is for a play feature, but or like a feature. But it just doesn't look like it looks kind of weird with this. It's like, it doesn't look like it's supposed to be flying with that opening. And for pieces that I like on this, um, these, like, whatever these are I like, just for the molding. Uh, the trans red bricks that are barely visible are really good, and I like the trans yellow piece. And I'm not, I don't know if that's, I'm sure that's probably not an exclusive print. Thing. It probably is stickered too. Or not. It's not coming off, so that's pretty much good. But the play feature with this one is. We're gonna need both mini figures for this. Um. Meet Emmett. Emmett's gonna go in this cart. Now, see, when I saw this originally in the store, I was like, I want that set. Because I had already wanted the set originally. And since Benny, this is Benny's spaceship, he's going to go up in the front. And what you're supposed to do is, you may have seen this in the time lapse when I tried this. You're going to roll um, him up, and then there's, the reason that there was a little bit of a weird system was, I didn't realize... That I was supposed to put the black and this, these two black pieces um, on the actual build. I am dumb. And underneath here, there is just a normal, like, stud piece. And it's just a single one, like, piece. And it just pushes down. It doesn't have the most secure connection. And it's popping out now. I wish that was a little bit better. Like, the connection joint would be a bit better. And I want to call... And now, with this in, it looks a much better. And in fact, I'm actually gonna... Because of... I like this. Okay, I can at least do that. Now it looks kind of cool. Now it looks like it's ready to fly. I mean, I wish we got, like, a blue tile. Like a 2 by. Six, a uh, two by six tie with piece for this. I'm sure I could find one and place it there. I'm sure I have one or even uh, two two by sixes or two by threes. But overall, I think this. W now, the main question I was wanting to answer in this was this set. <clears throat> 
zero seven zero eight two one no worth this was it worth twenty dollars or should I have actually asked for the AJ got the AJ Styles instead? Now with this I actually say besides the connection joint with the uh car and when I originally I mean, when I saw this, I actually thought this was going to be, I didn't realize it was just this cart that was going to be all that was holding it here. And in fact, I'm probably going to actually replace that brick to get a better connection. I'm not sure if they did it for a specific reason or not, but yeah, this is, this is definitely worth it, in my opinion. And this is probably a way too long reg Lego review. Because I watch uh, Just Too Good um, review videos. Yeah, his are going to be like maybe five. Like for this set, I'd probably predict a seven to ten minute long video. This is about 20 to review this four plus set. And overall, it took me... About 15 minutes to build, or 20 minutes to build, it can definitely be done, and for the parents, yeah, there's no stickers, which is nice, and for the kids that don't want to put on stickers, but, um, black piece, like the black construction pieces, kinda wish they were, I guess I can't blame them for making them this small, but I'm sure I'm gonna lose them immediately. So I'm actually just going to put my favorites where I actually, like, my favorites, like, the drill I'm actually, can't actually place, since there's no stick connection. I like the screwdriver piece. I like the screwdriver piece, and I guess the wrench, the slip wrench. So yeah, that's kind of what you're supposed to do. And then you're supposed to, like, attach X piece to like this or some crap. Yeah. So overall, I rate this set a out of ten, a solid eight. Maybe in seven and a half, seven and a half to an eight. This is definitely worth twenty dollars. Letters. Now would I have gotten this over in AJ Styles? I think I probably would, because I feel like I could probably get something out of this. Definitely not for foreshadowing anything to, um, anything related to, um, a certain thing going on soon between two wrestlers who are going to, uh, clash. Go, go, Masons, go watch our videos. And, yeah, this is my custom Kid Cody Rhodes, but I'm going to make a video about that all on its own. Bye for now. Okay, since I need to make another video, I'm just going to be clearing, uh, this is, re I'm recording this literally, like, as soon as I clicked done with, um, the, uh, Lego review, I'm already making another video. And what it, will this video be about? Well, it's going to be wrestling related, not Lego related. Which I'm sure for my mainly wrestling fans, my non-existent fans, might I add. Because I don't think anybody's going to watch that Lego video. I just did it because I wanted to get a video out that wasn't um, the pre-show for MWF Hardcore Mania. I'm going to be talking, and this figure did show up there, and that's just in the thumbnail. It is the kid, Cody Rhodes. Now, I'm sure you can already tell. Mason, why did you put mismatched arms? Well, I, uh, this is built out of a Tyson kid. I don't know if I have any other figure. Huh. I'm sure my brother will. I think, out of my crap bin, in fact, I'm actually going to check both now, just in case. Here we are at the crap. Larry Zabisco maybe had the truck skin tone, but 
I was gonna sacrifice that. Uh, Seamus, also not gonna sacrifice. Huh. My PS games. Oh. Yeah. Um, this. I think this could have actually maybe worked. Uh, this is apparently a Then Now Forever figure. Uh, here's, uh, the last High Dillinger, I believe. Nasty Boys. That's actually, that's actually a good figure, but I think, yeah, it suffers the same problem. I think this was before. So the Cactus Jack figure also suffered the same fate. The shirt is just a tad long for the legs. If there was a tad shorter, it would be good. And now, um, I actually don't think there's anything in that, but that would be good enough. But, yeah. So, with this, originally there was black boots. Then I swapped them out for the normal Cody Rose boots. And then, when I showed him this to my brother with the black boots, I realized it said kid on the back. So, oh no, what are we going to do? For right now, the easiest solution was call him the kid, Cody Rhodes. And that would explain the shortness. And then with uh, the arms. That's just my fault. Uh, that's just my fault for not realizing. Like, I'm sure. Like, I think the ball joints are a different skin color than this. And then these are different from this. And when I posted this on Reddit, I don't think anybody noticed. I mean, it has like 8 or 9 upvotes, which is pretty good. I posted this at yeah, r slash wrestling fig, wrestle figs. Which is not a big subreddit, but it's a better place to put this. I'll probably put this, I'll probably get this a better picture. Uh, r slash action figures, so, yeah. So that's just the, that video, and actually, what time is it? What time is it? What time is it? Oh god, it's 7.03, go, 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 stomping rounds is on. Ah, PS4 controller, get over here. Get on. And now I'm just gonna, okay, so it's uh, stomping rounds time, yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna go and watch stomping rounds now. Time to kick ass and take names. Let's go. It's not going to be good. Let's go.